In the wake of recent mass shootings, Governor Tom Wolf is again calling for what he says are common sense gun laws. Fox 43's Harry Lee has reaction from lawmakers. In the shadow of two recent mass shootings in Buffalo, New York and Uvalde, Texas, the NRA conference opens today, calling to defend gun rights. In Pennsylvania, a parallel event calls for stricter gun laws. <laughs> Governor Tom Wolf spoke in Philadelphia in favor of four gun control measures, requiring lost or stolen guns to be reported within 72 hours, a background check on all gun sales, requiring safe gun storage and red flag laws. These will not infringe on anybody's rights, anybody's constitutional rights. These laws would save lives. But on Wednesday, the GOP-controlled state house voted not to advance a law banning assault-style weapons. And what's the Republican leadership in Pennsylvania doing about it? Nothing. State Senate Republican leadership disagrees, saying in a statement, the legislature has a demonstrated track record for taking action to ensure our schools are safe and making investments and resources to minimize such risks. Measures they cite include a Pennsylvania school safety committee, the safe to say school threat reporting system, community safety grants to reduce community violence and trauma informed training for teachers. Democratic candidate for governor Josh Shapiro also offering a glimpse of how he would treat gun control in office. We need to close the ghost gun loophole here in Pennsylvania. It's the weapon of choice for criminals. We've got to close that loophole. The State House Republican Caucus responding. Among other measures, Pennsylvania already has one of the most stringent gun background check laws in the country and is considered a national model. The National Rifle Association did not respond to multiple requests for comment. Harry Lee, Fox 43 News.